Korea's biggest tech company is getting even bigger. Samsung Electronics unveiled plans for a gigantic factory. The plan, expected to begin rolling in the first half of 2017, got a head start thanks to the government's deregulation drive. Our Shin Zemin takes us to the scene. This construction site will be home to Samsung Electronics' new DRAM memory chip line at a cost of 14.5 billion U.S. dollars. It's being built in Pyeongtaek, 70 kilometers south of Seoul, and will officially begin churning out chips in the first half of 2017. With this addition to the already existing massive production line in Kihung and Hwasong, Samsung says it will be able to solidify its lead in the global chip business. The tech giant also aims to grow its presence in the semiconductor sector, hoping to drive up its sagging smartphone earnings. The Pyeongtaek project is massive, Samsung's largest ever investment in a single production line. It's expected to generate 150,000 jobs and produce $37 billion in revenue. In a written statement, the company said that the Pyeongtaek line will give the company a leg up in the Internet of Things industry. And since the new plant couples well with President Park Geun-hye's deregulation push, investments in the plant accelerated and the government was able to help with steady electric power and industrial water supplies. President Park attended the opening ceremony saying the government will continue to raise the competitiveness of the industry by eliminating regulations in order to boost high-value product industries like the system semiconductors. Since entering the market 40 years ago, Samsung Electronics has led the global memory chip market for the last 22 years. Shin Se-min, Arirang News.